how's it going? It's dark. And it's night time, so it's kind of quiet. Anyway, today, what I'm going to talk about is I went to Pizza Hut. And I had a Pizza Hut. They had the placemats, the kind that you can draw on. You know, they've got, like, crossword puzzles and general other things like that, which I'm glad to say I find much easier than the ones in the newspaper. But back, there were six questions. I shall answer these questions, and you should post a video response with your answer to these questions. The six questions are, let me read them to you. What if you could have a wild animal as a pet? choose and why what would I choose tiger tiger or a monkey maybe a sloth a baby sloth sloths are good they're lazy they don't do much tigers kind of kill people monkeys throw things around a sloth what if you had one million dollars. How would you spend it? Well, I'd buy a car and a lot of DVDs and a nice TV to watch them on, some nice sound, and a nice couch, and probably. A nice camera and a nice computer and some food and some other things. There we go. What if you were president for one day? What would you do? Well, I thought about this one long and hard, and I came to the conclusion that not much can get done in one day. So, if I was president for one day, I would take the day off and enjoy being the president without having to do anything at all. The fourth question. What if you had a genie that granted you one wish per day? How would you use them? Well, I would wish for money on the first day, then on the second day, I would wish for a lot more money, then on the third day, I would get a house, on the fourth day, I would get a car, on the fifth day, DVD ever. On the sixth day, after I had most of the things that I could want in a week, I would make sure that somebody else got something that they wanted. And on the seventh day, I would rest and not make any wishes at all. And save a wish. I wonder if it would work that way. If I go one day without making a wish, if I get two wishes the next day. But, one wish per day certainly is a lot better than three wishes all together. Anyway, the fifth question. What if you could travel back in time? When and where would you go? Well, I was watching Rome today. Ancient Rome seems like a pretty cool place. Maybe I'll go there. But then again, maybe we'll go somewhere else. Like New York in the 1970s. Why? But it could be interesting. Or perhaps. Eat.
Egypt. And the pyramids were being built. Or perhaps. I would go to the future, except the question does not say I can go to the future, it says the past. So, Rome, it has to be. The sixth and final question. What if you were stranded on an island with one possession? What would it be and why? Well, if I was stranded on a little island, you know, a little kind of island, it's like a little island with one palm tree, the kind that you see in The Far Side by Gary Larson. The possession I would have to have would must be that thing that Kevin Costner has in Waterworld that you pee in and it makes water. That would be a good thing to have on an island when there's no water. That's why I would have it. Anyway, those are the answers to these six questions. You will answer too.